What's up, Serial Heads? Today we're going to talk about grins, smiles, giggles, and laughs. Now, this cereal was released back in 1976, before I was born, so I never got to try it. But it has sort of a cult following, much like Freaky Cereal of the same era. And I think this might be the oldest unopened box of cereal that I own, around 40 years old. And the name is kind of long for a kid's breakfast cereal, but at least there's a story behind it. See, this robot in the front of the box, his name's Cecil, and he creates these smiley face cereal pieces. But the only way the machine works is if Cecil finds something funny. So these other characters here have to try to make him laugh so that he creates a cereal. These bozos are going to try to get me to laugh up some grins and smiles and giggles and laughs. The deliciously sweet, crunchy, corny cereal that smiles back at you. <laughs> Give that disappearing act some grins and smiles and giggles and laughs. The crunchy cereal that smiles back at you. So the four characters are named Grins, Smiles, Giggles, and Laughs. They don't really have any distinctive personalities, but this guy here is Grins. Here's Smiles, although he's not really smiling. Giggles, of course, was a woman character because it was the 70s and that's just how things went. And here's Laughs, making, I guess, a funny pose or something. So back in the 1970s, they went all out on prizes and cereal premiums that you could send away for, and this cereal was no exception. To promote this cereal, Ralston had about 5,000 of these lamps made and sent to store owners. These things will fetch a pretty penny if you can find any of them on eBay. On the side of this box, they had a Grin Smiles, Giggles and Laughs t-shirt that you could send away for for just $2.75. And most of the boxes included cool prizes inside too. Some of them had joke books inside, and they also had stickers and pens and magnets, all kinds of cool things you could collect. This box supposedly includes a free paint book inside. On the back here, it shows these kids having a fun time painting, and it supposedly comes with its own paints and funny jokes. This stuff has been sealed for about 40 years. I think it's time to open it up. You can see this cereal cost about 72 cents when it was on sale back in 1976. So back in 1976, I guess they used to use this foil packaging. So supposedly this is the free paint book inside, but I didn't see any paints. I'm gonna open it up and take a look. So here's the joke book, and it looks like I was wrong. So I guess these are the free paints included inside. You just dampen them with a cotton swab or a paintbrush and go to work. It's kind of a cool prize. If somebody wants this, I'll give it away to a lucky viewer. Just check the details down in the description. So here's what a bowl of grins, smiles, giggles, and laughs looks like. You can see the little smiley face cereal pieces. Now I'd be crazy to try this stuff, it's about 40 years old. But it is cool to be able to take a look at some cereal that came out before I was even born. This cereal was discontinued after only about a year or so. But years later in the 80s, it seems like Ralston re-employed the robot Cecil to make these colorful smiley faces for morning funnies. It was essentially the same cereal, just much, much sweeter. I do love how the older cereals from the 70s put a lot of thought into their mascots and advertising. They created whole backstories and fun characters to go along with their products. I feel like the cereals these days are missing that. Okay, that'll do it for Grin, Smiles, Giggles, and Laughs. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay crunchy. <laughs> cereal time.